If you guys are looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 22 Ultimate Team coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and they have 24-7 support. Head over to MuttReserve.com and use code Poodle at checkout for 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over the first Legend Saturday of Madden 22, guys. Super hype. Super good cards. Some names that I'm not actually used to seeing with certain stats, right? Like a Brandon Marshall that's fast and good route running. Usually, he's just a catch traffic beast. He's kind of built like a DeAndre Hopkins, a bit slower. But nonetheless, guys, for today's video, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, give this video a big thumbs up. As always, if you want to be shouted out in the Poodle Squad. All you got to do is like the video and comment down below. Poodle Squad. Today's shout out goes out to Peyton Hofer or Hofer. Hofer. I don't know. Thank you so much, man, for being part of the Poodle Squad. Greatly appreciate you and each and every one of you that comment every day. And yeah, guys, make sure to smash the like button for the first Legends Saturday. Now, if you guys are new to Legends Saturday, know that this is going to be weekly content. This drops every single Saturday, as it typically does. Now, this is going to be the first one, so there will be like eight Legends. Typically, it will be only like two to three weekly, but there'll be eight for the first one. So do know that that's going to be one of the things that you're going to be getting used to. If you're new to Madden, and if you're kind of like kind of new, have an idea. This is going to be one of the biggest weekly things we're gonna have every week when have this and then eventually later in the year ultimate legends so on and so forth so we have the legends tab now make your team first class with legends compete three missions and sets every week to earn extraordinary legends players so if you go into here guys earn a nat novus edition legend this feature releases legends ed reed this this release features legends ed reed and brandon marshall complete these activities to earn some nat novus edition so that means you could probably earn some free lower versions of their cards so you can go ahead and complete the set for cheaper uh, and then, of course, over here, you can see their sets and everything else. Let's see if they did add any um, objectives, legend-based objectives. Because remember, this year, with the way things work, there's going to be objectives for promo. So it'll be cool if they add some legends objectives. So you can go ahead and play them like you do with Superstar. I actually don't see any. Uh, so maybe not. It would have been nice, though, if they did add that. I mean, it still could come. You know, it's still a little bit early. Now, this release may not be... The, the legends won't be in-game for probably a while, considering the fact that the auction block is uh, banned so with the auction block being banned right now or, or locked and there's no packs i assume that legends probably won't be out in the game for quite a bit so um you know this you'll probably see this when they probably are out in game but moving on down guys we do have like i said the missions tab here this is all 12 you want to go see all the players and stuff and then of course you have these solo challenges so let's go over to the solos and check them out as well if you go over here there's still no art because they are coming in game slowly legends are back new legends arrive every week complete these challenges to earn their power versions and complete their sets to earn a boss legend legends release one if you complete all this it seems like you just get coins and if you go through here every single player every single one you do now i like these a lot better because these aren't full games anymore they are going to just be objective based when the game it starts in like the third quarter they all start in the third quarter three minutes left so you play these guys if you go into it you will get a legends token which you will need to go ahead and get your free legend which i will go over in just a second yes guys you will be getting a free nat boss legend i'll go over the whole set um now to show you guys what i'm talking about here so you got if you see in the bottom right here next to my face like right there if you play you get their power up and you get a legends token so go ahead if you want to get any of these legends one good coin making method actually is, is as soon as legends do drop go into this and play it as quickly as possible because of the auction house ban that might not be too useful at this moment typically if you see like a banger legend like a randy moss or dm people are lazy they'll pay 15k for the power up just not play the solo so make sure you guys go ahead every saturday and go to the best legend that came out for that week and play the solo as quickly as possible chew clock it through it and just put their power up for like 10 15k whatever it goes for and you could probably make some easy coins weekly so there's darrell revis demarcus ware michael strand johnny unitas ladanian thomason bruce matthews ed reed and brandon marshall at first glance from yesterday my favorite one here is probably going to be brandon marshall's insane brandon marshall uh darrell revis ed reed strahan they're all demarcus ware they're all good the only one i really don't care for too much is bruce matthews uh and ladanian thomason i don't care for as much because i do have saquon i'm a giants fan so i'll probably just rock with the saquon um i already have him powered up and everything i'll probably end up sticking with him but these um these, these solos are cool. Now I did read before that we get the Nat the Nat Novus player. So I wonder how that actually does work. So let's go back there real quick. Guys, so all the art is officially in the game, which means we can go ahead and actually open our bundle. It's probably thrown in somewhere between the video at some point here. Um, of course, I went through the content stuff first, but now we got the we got the fun stuff. We have a pack opening to do here, so that's pretty exciting. Heading over to browser store. We have some unopened packs as well, which I believe are my Novus Legend Fantasy packs. So again, if you guys know what those are, those are gonna be the packs I guess from earlier. They get to play the solos. We had about an hour, give or take, in between the legends actually dropping and the solos and everything coming out and the everything else with the packs and stuff. So do understand that I got a few things in the meantime. So the eight times legend fantasy bundle, a hundred bucks as per usual. Now, if you buy these separately, eight of these, it will cost pretty much. Oh, it then cost the exact same price actually. 
exact same price but you do get the 82 pluses 85 plus which is very important so let's go cop this real quick we'll be right back so let's get into this pack opening we have 32 golds at minimum 10 elites minimum 88 plus so 3.7 percent 86 plus is a 16 percent which is actually really good this is gonna be a fire bundle guys that first legend bundle usually hits different now we want brandon marshall he's easily the craziest legend of the bunch trust me so let's get into this first round guys i have not opened up a legend fantasy bundle all year obviously but in a long time we get some golds here. We get some gold. We can hit elites in the first round. It's always big. Um, no elites, straight gold. So let's make sure we just make let's just take the high gold so we can always exchange them for some elites later on. All right. So first we get an elite here. Let's see. We got 80 TJ Hawkinson. That's that's garbage. We get a superstar MVP player, 80 Terrell Edmonds, and we get a high low legend, right? Low legend. Yeah, damn, that's that one's not too good. Okay, I mean, again, we could always go ahead and build some legends out of these. I once had a pack opening, guys, last year where I pulled like 588 overall Deons and 588 overall Michael Vicks. I didn't pull a single full legend, but those 88 overall Deons and Vicks went for 400k each. I literally made like 3.5 million coins off that crap. Like that was that was that was a good one. And I at first was upset until I saw the price of them. But it's pretty much it was the equivalent of pulling them like the full one a bunch of times. The key to this pack opening is gonna be hitting in these early rounds. Honestly, that's that's what it's gonna be here. We got to hit early. We got to power up. Okay, so the beginning rounds look like they're going to be garbage, honestly. Uh, let's take this. Let's take that. All right, so we got an elite here as well. Pretty, pretty much going to hit an elite there every time. Chris Hare, another elite right there. And we get 80 Dante Jackson. We get another legend, low legend as well. 84 LT, though. That's, that's not a bad one. That one goes probably like 25K. Um, so far, so far, not too great. So far, it is not looking too great here. I got to go to, I got to hit next pack. Uh, I need the coin, so please give me some heat out of these because I cannot. I need the coins. I really do. Oh, Superstar MVP right there. Gold. Gold. Oh, power up. Byron Jones. Pene Sewell. I'll take the power up, of course. Take that. Take that. All right. So, we get another elite here. Probably going to be a trash elite. 82 Terry McLaurin. Another elite right there. And we get another low legend. Oh, God. Brandon Marshall, though. I do want him. Please, don't do me dirty. Don't do me dirty. We're down to five. Oh, we still have five packs, but still, don't do me dirty. Don't, don't. I like a pack opening when I don't have to care about the topper. Those are the pack openings I like. When I have to care about the topper, I get very upset because the topper is going to make or break me and it's just super, just super stressful. I like when I can just go ahead and know that the topper is not going to really matter. Okay, we got a superstar MVP. I'll take a full one though, if that was possible, or a high one, just so I can go ahead and make some more. We got another low legend here. Damn. That wasn't the guaranteed spot though. Another low legend. I guess I'll take the Ed Reed. Oh, God, yay. I keep backing out of these. I mean to click next and never do it. Oh God. Okay, we're down. To, we're halfway through. I mean, we've got we we need some higher ones though, obviously, because I can't I can't just make them without. Those aren't even the expensive ones. Can we please hit in these early rounds? Jesus, how hard is it to hit an elite in these early rounds? I'm taking all these rookies though because I can't go ahead and put those into the uh, the set. I right, got an elite here. Ooh, we slipped up to the back. Another low one. Oh my God. Oh. Are we really not gonna get an above 84 pull here? I I, I already know Zerk's gonna FaceTime me after this video and call me with his full his two full legends he got. This is unbelievable. Comment down below Poodle Luck or something. We, we still we still have a chance here, but come on. Ooh, legend. Oh, high legend in the low round. 87 straight hand out of the first round. And an elite? Am I in the wrong round? Where was this all? Where was this all pack opening? I get a high one out of this one? That's that's garbage, but I'll take it. That's good though, guys. That's the expensive one. So that, that one might go for like 100 k that's a good one. I'm excited. That means I can build Strayhand now for pretty cheap. I'm actually really excited about that. All right. We got another low legend here, but I'm, I'm happy now. Definitely happier with the prospects of this pack opening because that's got to go for at least 100k. And I can now go ahead and build Strayhand. I'm, I'm a Giants fan, so I guess I was probably going to build them anyways. Uh, Strayhand's usually really, really good. Pretty fast as well. He's one of the good ones. We still have the 85 plus, which we can still hit on there. Can we hit in the early round again? That last early round was crazy. Ooh, another high legend in the early round. We got... We pulled Brandon Marshall. We pulled the 90 over. We pulled the best one in the first round. That's crazy. We pulled Brandon Marshall. Guys, this is the best one. This is literally the best legend that you could pull. 90 overall Brandon Marshall. Oh, guys, this is what I was talking about. We got to hit in the first. We got to hit in the first. I hate that he's slower than Jamar, though, because that's that's garbage. Brandon Marshall's absolutely crazy, guys. He's a... I'm going to go over his stats later. We don't have time to go through all this, but that is wild. Imagine I didn't take him because I have a choice here. Let's fly through this round now. Oh my god. Imagine I didn't take him. I'm so... I'm like nervous. He's not going to give it to me. That is... Did I just reveal this whole round? Did I just reveal this whole round? I will take that Darrell Rivas though. Guys, this pack opening is getting crazy. 
Holy crap. My packs are juiced. My packs are juiced. My packs are juiced. I gotta, I'm gonna tweet out mid video. Hold up, guys. I gotta tweet this out. Go like this tweet when you see it. Wow, this was this was starting off so bad. And we we we, we got it. We got it going. It's probably gonna be a pretty long video. Holy crap, I'm hype. Can we hit in the early? I mean, I think at this point it doesn't even matter. I don't even care. Can we hit in the early rounds? I'll take him, take him. I gotta go do some sets after this. I'm gonna have a lot of stuff. All right, basically, basically, garbage, garbage. And we get another low legend. Okay, Demarcus. We're, we're gonna be able to build a lot, though. I have Brandon Marshall. I don't even gotta build him. I got him. And I'm gonna power his ass up, too. Don't demonetize me for that. All right, guys. We have the 85 pluses here. These are gonna be great regardless. These are going to be great regardless. High legend, of course. Can we get another full one? Ladanian Tomlinson, though. I guess I'll take that because I can go build the LT now. I don't really want LT, though. I want to stick with Saquon. You know what? Maybe if L... Uh, I don't know. This is tough. This is tough. I don't know. I'm going to have to check out the coins and everything afterwards. Got to get to editing this and get this up for you guys so you can see. Can we pull another full edge? Give me Ed Reed here real quick. Michael Strahan. All right. I think I actually can pretty much build Strahan at this point. Guys, that's pretty much it. That's it for the video. I'm um, going to go back to the content stuff, obviously, but this was a crazy, crazy bundle. All right. To the missions tab to show you guys that because... That can go a long way in completing these sets. So, complete complete these missions and sets to earn uh, the week to earn the legends. So, we're here. What does this say here? Beat Ed Reed's challenge. Beat Brandon Marshall's challenge. Earn a one star to earn a Nat Novice legend. So, I'm pretty sure a Novice legend is going to be the bottom tier of their collection. So, I wonder how that works. I mean, maybe it'll be random. Now, wait, hold up. Does it work for all of them? Do you get like one for each single one? Let's go back here. Let's go to missions legends again. Let's go to that tab. That could be pretty cool. It could make these uh, sets a little bit cheaper, actually. So, earn a Nat Novus Legend. Earn a Nat Novus Legend. Earn a Nat Novus Legend. This... Okay, so you have to play them in two. So, Darrell Revis and Demarcus where you have to play both their challenges. And then earn a one-star rating on each, at least each one. And then you get your stuff. So, you're going to only get four Novus uh, Legends out of the eight. But you have to play two solos at a time. So, you'll see them. They're all bunched together. And you can go ahead. So, now let's go to the set and check that out. Because that's actually pretty interesting as well. If we go over to the set here. Let's go to Legends. And check this out. We go to the players. So if you go over to the set, these are the sets they are referring to. And technically, so if you go into here, the Nat Novus Legend, I wonder which one's going to be the the Novus going to be the bottom tier one. Okay, so you're not going to be able to see him because the auction block's unavailable. So you're going to get the lowest one. Now the lowest one may only go for like, again, if he's like an 82 overall, 84 overall, he could still go for like 15k. That's still saving some coins. If you get all four of them, you can go ahead and complete these sets for a lot cheaper. Now me personally, the two the legends that I'm going to personally get for my team, I definitely think I need Ed Reed. Right, he's going to be a goon. Yeah, I think you need Ed Reed. So, earn legends tokens for a Nat Boss legend. So, these are going to be the tokens. You can kind of see the art there a little bit. Now, if you go on down all the way, there's a total of 40. So, if you get 40 of these, you will be able to go ahead and get a Nat Boss legend. Now, I don't know if it'll be a fantasy pack. It'll probably be random. Now, when will you receive this? It really just depends. So, they did eight this week, right? Now, let's say they dropped... It could be two legends weekly from here on out. It could be three. But let's assume it was like last year. I believe it was two. So, there'll be a total of eight week one. So eight tokens you could potentially get week one. Then from here on out, it will go ahead and be on a schedule of probably like three. Uh, sorry, two, give or take, let's just say. So two, four, six, eight, ten. So it'll take like a month. Every month you get, let's say, approximately ten, give or take. So you might not get this till around like January, maybe February. Again, maybe 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 December. It really depends. I don't know how they're going to do this here on out. It, it could be four Legends weekly. It could be three Legends weekly, which would ex exponentially increase that timeline. But overall, you do get eight. So make sure you guys do play these eight because these are going to be the biggest head start you can get. If you don't go ahead and play your early solos, like I said, if you don't know where to get them, I'll go show you again. If you don't play these solos, you're going to be significantly far behind because they only do two weekly, let's say. That means it would take you over a month to get 10. So you're getting eight off the rip. So you're pretty much going to be a month behind everyone if you don't play these solos. Make sure you do go ahead and actually play them. You see here, like I said, all you got to do is come play them on their one star. That's the only star you can really get them on. You got to do Rel Revis power up and a Legends token. All you got to do is the requirements. Make sure you follow the requirements. Some people will chew clock and not really need five tackles. So what I'd recommend is if you start off on offense, you could chew clock right away, but hopefully start off on defense, get your tackles done. And if you don't get your tackles, punt it back, get your tackles done, and then you could chew clock out of there. Now, let's see, these are Donald Latsu touchdowns. Um, get four plus tackles. There's a bunch. There's a bunch of different objectives. Pass for 100 plus yards. Win the game. Ladainian Thompson rush for 75 yards. There's plenty of stuff here. But yeah, if you guys do want to see a bundle, let me know down below. I will get a bundle there for you guys if you do want to see one. So comment down below if we get a 50 likes in this video. I'll drop a bundle. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. If you guys want to be shouted on the Poodle Squad, all you got to do is like the video. Comment down below, Poodle Squad. If you guys need coins, head over to Mutt Reserve down below. 
Big Legends drop. Like I said, you're going to need some coins. I'm going to probably need to pick up some coins too or do a bundle because I don't know how I'm going to get all these players. Heading over down there. Make sure you use code Poodle at checkout. 15% off your order. And yeah, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you for watching. Hopefully the Legends and everything is in game in a, in a good amount of time. But yeah, I'm out. Enjoy the rest of your day. Peace.